What's up, Boise River Floaters? We're down here on the river right now. I wanted to make this video and share a couple of tips, some knowledge, um, some things that might be happening in the future with the river this summer, what it might look like. Nice and safe for everybody. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> so this year the summer season's kind of constricted on what we can do. A lot of things are closed. I know the public pools are closed, but we have a lot of things that are open. Ponds, lakes, rivers. You wanna stay away from canals, they're really dangerous. A lot of people can get hurt in those and they're not kept, they're not meant for people to be in them. We can project a little bit about what the float season might look like when it opens this year, about how things have gone in the past. In the past, we have things like the shuttle bus, costs three dollars a person and at Barbara Park you can pay to park there and it costs six dollars per car. Something funny about the Boise River is that it doesn't actually close, it doesn't have a floating season. Now the float season consists of just having Barbara Park pretty much set up their pumps. They also have the shuttle buses, of course the tube and raft rentals, all the gear rentals. That starts when they open. But as far as the river goes, the river doesn't close. The river's open all year round. Just be cautious. It's really important to be safe no matter when, what time of year you're doing things like this. My biggest worry this year is crowding. I feel like there's gonna be a lot of people coming down bumping into each other. I hope everybody knows how to swim. I know that when you rent gear, it's required for you to have a life jacket. I'm sure one thing they're trying to figure out right now is the shuttle situation. That's really the most dangerous part where packing everybody into one little bus and carrying them around, that, that might not work this year. It takes about two and a half yeah. hours if you're on a small craft and just floating. I'm sure it can take less time. Depends on what kind of craft you're on. My boat, it takes, it can take up to three, three and a half hours because it just slugs along. Whenever I get into some slow moving water, it seems to stop sometimes. You'll see that in the videos. When I float and stop and fish and swim, it can take anywhere from five to six hours. So right now up at Barbara Park, the air is turned off, but you know, I got my little pump from Walmart. I was able to air up my boat. It was definitely doable. And if you have a tube or some kind of small raft, it is very, very simple to air them up. If you need to transport yourself from Ann Morrison Park, all you gotta do is just park one car at the bottom, drive to the top and park, get on and float, and you'll have to either be able to take your whole party back up to the first car at Barber Park to pick that up, or just send somebody, the driver, to go pick it up. If you plan on taking your children on the river, make sure they drink enough water lose a lot of water when you're out here on the water, under the sun, sweating. You just lose a lot of moisture. So make sure that make sure that they get hydrated before getting on the river and then while you're on the river try to encourage them to drink water. Kids don't like to hydrate, especially when they're out here doing this kind of thing. And it's important to drink plenty of water yourself as an example. 
example, you can show them just you don't have to tell them. So I know that anybody that is experienced enough, knows how to swim, has their own gear, can come down here and enjoy basically any part of the river, any time of year, whenever they want. There's a lot to learn about this river when you're floating it, as far as which way to go, where's the safest place to take the rapids. And I try to answer a lot of those questions from some of my other videos. I try to point out some spots to fish, some places to swim. You know, I, I want people to enjoy themselves, keep the rivers clean, and be safe while having as much fun as possible.